Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Vampire the Masquerade Blood Hunt. We're picking up uh, with a new game, so let's see how this goes here. We'll try going to the terrors since I do have that quest objective. And I think for this episode, once again, we are going to go, uh, at least for this match, depending on how long this goes, we'll go Vandal again. I, I did like playing as this character. The only problem is every time I went to go pick up equipment, I kept pressing E instead of F. And the ability is E and F is to pick up. So I still have yet to change that keybind. I might do it here. We'll see though. Because uh, otherwise it's it's kind of messing me up a little bit. Um, but yeah, as always, if you guys enjoy the video, definitely leave a like on it. Subscribe for more too. Because uh, it's been a little bit since I played this game and I saw there was a few requests or the uh, previous video part one is still doing really good. So I did want to jump back in and try to get a few more episodes out for it uh, sporadically and then also check out new content for it too. Last episode we went to all the new quests uh, people that you could pick up items from or things like that so that was uh, pretty good. Alright let's see what we got here like the quest objective actually is right on the other side of this i like how they actually give you an icon and it's not like just a puzzle you go oh, go find it yourself at least that's what it looks like we do have a chest right here ah so that's what that key is for the last episode i found the keys out in the open but I wasn't sure where you're supposed to use them or uh, open it. Wait, what am I supposed to do at the terrace? Uh, uh oh, kind of nervous. Uh, is it? Is there a way of even seeing? I don't think there is. If I open the map, maybe. Uh, search a, the area for a, retrieve the record. I don't know what I'm supposed to do at the terrace. I don't know. Let me, let me try going back up. It looks like it's something right here. Or at least the icon shows right here. Is this it? Pop record. Ah, there we go. Okay. So we found that. If we find one of those keys, at least I know where to go now. I'm kind of in the middle of playing as like this type of class or going back to the Muse again. Because I was playing as the Muse for a while. I hope this person doesn't see me. Uh, and I, I really like them because whenever you feed on people, they never really know. Which is the nice thing. And then also gain up to one extra life. I don't know if this is going to affect what I currently have since I already have one life. But Okay. I'm like really avoiding pressing E right now. <laughs> Alright, let's go up. Still don't really have any good weapons just yet. Really? I would miss. So you gotta get really lucky with this thing. Not really lucky, but more like really accurate. Broke their armor. Oh god, I'm being shot from behind. Yeah, I need to get like a new gun or something. I don't think I'm going to be very accurate with this two pistols right now. Uh, is there something here? I would love like a game like this. If they took everything they built here and built like a single player experience. Or I uh, like th with this style of running around and shooting and enemies and then like some cinematic moments things like that 
as a vampire in third person oh that would be so good that would be so much fun reload hey not bad take that what the heck how'd you have so many good weapons and you didn't huh know about that get back here okay i actually really liked how those pistols were working back there so although there's a sniper rifle i could grab right there i'm just gonna hold on to this open up this okay nice nice uh do i i still don't have any blood uh, i think that was the same person Here's a key. What is that? Oh, that's somebody in here. Oh, that was so bad. That was so, so bad. Oh, no. Ah, oh, man. That was just a bad uh, outcome regardless. Okay, let's look. Attempt to find another life. I don't know, a little nervous because we don't have many options here. Priority, find a life. That's number one. You know, every time, I think it was the same guy too. Yep, it was, I think so. Open eye. All right, well, you know, it happens, it happens. You can't w get close for everyone. You can't win them all. This guy's level, also level 69, so it's been playing the game for a little bit, that's for sure. <laughs> but, all right, uh, looks like we can go into the next one then. Since this one was pretty short, uh, so I'll queue up, and then once we get into the next match, we'll go ahead and continue. Uh, looks like actually we got two eliminations, so not horrible. Player level, still level 11. Uh, damage dealt, Vandal. Okay, so we leveled the Vandal up to a higher level, and we completed a few challenges here, actually. Used discipline. Nice. Okay. Now I'll pause until we get into the next match. All right. We are back in another match here. So let's see. Uh, let's go over to the helipad. I don't think I've ever really been over here before. Or at least it's been a while if I have. Hopefully this time around we do a little bit better. Yeah, we'll go as the uh, Vandal once again. That's fine. I'm surprised you can't choose, like while you're selecting your character, I'm surprised you can't choose what ability you have or what special you bring in. Like for the default is Bandolier, but um, but yeah. So we'll, we'll see how this uh, match goes here. Hopefully get a good one or we do a little bit better than last time. We still got at least two eliminations, which was good, but uh, we'll see. Nice, we spawned in right next to this store. Of course, we're gonna set off the alarm though while we're doing it, but that's fine. You know, that's part of it. That's all part of it. Little crossbows. Open up all of these. We'll grab the armor. Actually keep the, that. And you know what? I'll take the dual pistols instead. I feel like a little bit more confident with these rather than the uh, 
the shotgun. So, thank you. Come again. All right. Let's see what we got here. Uh, nothing there. What's this person? One health per second. I'll take that. I still haven't memorized any of the abilities, like what they mean as color color wise. I mean, like the uh, purple one, the other two, all that stuff. Oh, did I just see somebody jump into the air? I mean, I could go into the fight. The only problem is I don't have like the best weapon right now. But. Go ahead and eat this guy real quick. Got him. on the NPC. All right, let's uh, take this real quick too. Armor up a little. Okay. I don't think they had any really good weapons here. Yeah, it was all uh, silenced SMG. Not bad. Oh! put this armor back on <laughs> not bad see personally like i get it you want to run back to the person that killed you but i always prioritize uh lasting a little bit longer in the match than going after them right away unless if he just spawned in and he decided to run towards me that's fine too uh two seconds nice or two health per second. That's pretty good. Take that. Uh, nothing here. That's fine. Let's get up to the top. But yeah, I, I was saying a while ago, if they made a game with this, uh, using like every a lot of the same mechanics for this and put it into a single player story, I mean, not only would it remind me of like Infamous, but also, I, I feel like it would be so good. Because we don't have, like, enough vampire games. I know they're they're obviously working on uh, Vampire, The Masquerade, uh, what is it, Bloodlines? <laughs> Everything. All their games have, like, the same name, so it's always hard to tell. But uh, Bloodlines 2 is going to be... Uh, Hopefully we see some more about that game soon. We haven't heard anything in a very long time. Nice. Lots of armor here. Still haven't found uh, many good weapons, but looks like there might be some high tier loot here. Do I see a chest anywhere? Nothing so far. Increased melee damage? Eh, I don't know if I really want to get that. Rather hold my <clears throat> my points for something else. There's a lot of shots going off behind me. Melee damage. Regain one extra life. We already have one right now, so we should be okay. I, I would love to see uh, more third person open world games although like obviously they get very, very repetitive but a vampire one would be sick i know there's that infamous dlc which i think i played forever ago but man i, I would give anything for those infamous games to come to pc or like remaster them or something oh it would be so good replaying those
Maybe one day if I get like a PS5. If I end up getting a PS5 for God of War or any future games too. Then it could be a possibility. But uh but I don't know. I think only like Second Son is on there. I don't even know if the original infamous one or two. Okay. Still nothing. I'm looking for like weapons and stuff. Heard somebody. I climbed up to the top here. A lot of shots going off over there. I still really only have these two weapons, which is not good. I use the syringe that way. We do, go, do get into any fights, we have that. <laughs> like fireworks going off in the sky. Open up this. Nothing. I will take the bat, though. You know, I'm also surprised we haven't gotten, like, a... Every time I see, like, a spiked bat, I'm sure most people think of Walking Dead. But for whatever reason, it makes me think of The Purge, even though I haven't really, like, watched those movies. I would love to actually see a Purge game, though. It's literally just a battle royale, but, like, I'm surprised that nobody's been like, Hey, you know, we, there's this market over here that we could just go in and uh, make some games. I feel like they would do all right. Just from me. Oh god, there's like three parties here. It's gonna be interesting. Nice. Reload. Is this the same person from before? Oh god. Oh no. This is pretty bad. No. Yeah, I should have just left. Ah, they got me. Alright. Well, there's only 10 people left if we uh, spawn in fast. Or there's 12. If we spawn in fast, then there's a chance. I think once there's like 10 or like 8 something around there then you can't get uh or you can't respawn anymore even if you have a life they'll just like take it from you so definitely grab this Come on i do want to try to prioritize the second life though shots going off everywhere right now can't scan Trying to scan. Come on, somebody somewhere. Oh, there's another person. I'm not even going to bother going after them yet. Just going to try to hold. There's like a few up there. I have no good weapons. I'm literally done. Oh man. There might there might be a chance. Do they just like get into trouble? Somebody else? What the heck? What happened there? Oh no, of course. And this might be it, this is GG. Yeah. Cold Moon 7, they got me. Nine out of uh, that many people, that's not too bad, I guess. I guess that's not too bad.
But, uh, yeah, let's go back to the area and see what we got if we unlocked anything new. So we got about two eliminations there, I think. Player level, we leveled up, it looks like. And Vandal is still level two. Let's see what challenges we completed. Nice, we got 30 headshots. 30 out of 60. All right, let's hit next, and it'll take us back to Elysium. And let's see what we have here. If anything. Well, Challenges complete. New rewards unlocked. Cool. So right now we're tier four. I think this is like a second season or something. I, I did end up buying the, the pass for the first one, but I never did anything with it. <laughs> so, whatever. Wait, is that a tattoo? Oh, okay, so we got a new tattoo. That's cool. What else is in here? Let's see what... So Summer Pass is completely different. That's cool. The Unstable Assailant. The Master of Death. That Those tattoos are pretty cool, too. Oh, my gosh. Candy Dance? What is that? <laughs> oh, that's pretty cool. Rare Breed. I like those. Interesting. Let's go to, like, store real quick. I'm just curious. See, the one thing is some of these are, like, locked to classes, which I think is a little bit disappointing, personally. Yeah, like, these are all mute. Like, I get it. Uh, only, like, one class can wear something. I kind of get it, but I don't know. Some of these, like, seem like generic clothing options with a little bit of different patterns and coloring colorations. So, personally, I'm not a big fan. I wish I could wear, like, anything. I never realized when I unlocked... Uh, the enforcer's outfit that it was only the enforcer like i wish other people could wear this they can wear the face mask but they can't wear the actual clothing option uh yeah we still haven't unlocked anything so at level three you get the next one but cool uh challenges quests i don't think we finished any of these yeah we didn't, still didn't do any that's fine though all right, well, that's going to be the end of this video. So as always, if you guys did enjoy it, definitely leave a like on it. Stop by with the live stream sometime. That's where I play all my main games. Um, and for now, if you do want some more, definitely let me know in the comments because that's kind of what's been gauging what I'm playing currently, trying out new games or uh, going back to some older ones. I am going to do a little bit of Unlisted. So that might already be up by the time this video posts, but if not, you might be able to expect that soon, uh, which I know it's a, a lot different game, but it's still my top video on the channel to this day. So for now, as always, thank you for watching and I'll see you all in the next one. Peace.